to your department, did anyone in government uh, instruct public servants to conjure up an economic narrative to support its decision to invoke the Emergencies Act? Emergencies Act? No. Um, um, was the government informed at any point by public servants that the economic data, data either didn't exist, that it did not answer the questions you wanted to be answered, or did not produce the results you preferred to hear? And if so, did the government instruct those public servants to generate numbers to back up its claims, regardless of the data problems? Mr. Motz, I am Canada's finance minister. I was our chief negotiator during the NAFTA negotiations, or I led the negotiations, assisted very ably by Steve Verhuel. Uh, I personally had many conversations and read many reports, which caused me to be very concerned about the economic consequences of the illegal blockades and occupation. I spoke directly with Canadian business leaders who told me that they were hearing from investors that their confidence in Canada as an investment destination was shaken. I spoke directly from and read the comments of many U.S. political leaders who spoke about how the blockades I'm were sorry, encouraging Minister, but, protectionism But my question was about Canada. within your own department. So uh, you may not be aware of this, but there's a reason I'm asking that question. So, uh, you may not be aware of this, but there's a reason I'm asking that question. There's a reason I'm asking that question. There's a reason I'm asking that question.